Hey guys, welcome back. We got issues. Oh no, I missed it! Is there another one? Okay, they're all dead. Oh, you poor thing. Uh, we're gonna bake some berries. That gives Foxy something to do. What was I doing? Oh, I was sending off for our adventure today. I wanted more arrows made. Alright, Daydream, start working. Stay in there. Oh, there's an egg. I want the egg. Okay, so we'll need to get some flame organs. So how many do I have? 102. So anyway, guys. Hey, that was fun. Welcome back to AGP. Today we're going to go check out that town that I was talking about. Remember when we went off a little ways past where that... uh cave was we saw smoke and there was a little town i figured we go check that out do a little bit exploring because remember we need to catch 10 more pals and i like to get 10 different pals that we don't already have so that is my game plan for the day 132 is good come on let's go i'd also oh pal deck oh shit Okay, that's not really what I wanted you guys to do. I kind of wanted to catch it. Guys. I'm trying to catch. Please. Please. Because they will kill it. Thank you. Well, that's no goo. Daydream is knocked out. For 10 minutes. Oh. Uh, we'll run with this crew then. Alright. Did I bring? I have the money and I have the ruby. Because I want to sell the ruby. More arrows. That's good. What the fuck? Oops. Cool. Can I have all this? <gasps> A vixen. Vixie. Come here. You know, I don't want to... I'm going to try it. Ow! Come on, baby. Come on, give me that Vixie. Yeah, let's go! Oh, hell no, bitch. Oh, you put your higher level. Can I hit you again? I can. I'll try again, because you're a higher level than that three. Bam. Okay, what levels do we have? We have a five and a five. <gasps> oh, shit. I didn't see him. Ah, you hit a tree, dumbass.
Yeah, I got him. This is how we do it. Small settlement. This means it could be a nice place. Hi. Innkeeper, welcome. Haven't seen your face before. Did you come from far away? Must have been a long journey. Take your time and rest up. Okay. Gossiping villager. Ever explore cave? I heard the caves are home to loads of unique pals. What's more, there are even treasure troves created by pals with the knack for collecting stuff. Nice. Give me a shout if you spot any caves, won't you? I've actually seen two. Can I have... No. Oh, hi, pal merchant. Hey there. I've got some pals in stock. No funny business and only legit training. It's trading guaranteed. What the fuck are you? I'd like to have these, but I ain't got the money. So bye. Oh, another merchant. I've got some good items in stock. Actually, I've got a ruby that I need to sell. Cool. Now what do you got? Really nothing I want. Sorry, buddy. Hello, Mr. Man. Reliable PIDF officer. Hey, pal tamer. There's hardly anyone around here now, but before the rain syndicate came, many more people lived here. Because of them, my income has really taken a hit, you know? If you're in trouble, let me know. As long as you pay, I'll do anything. He looks like a toy soldier. He doesn't even look like an NPC. He just looks like straight up NPC. Ever above it, you're extraordinarily strong and big. Oh, shit. Um, 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 ow. That was rude. You interrupted my talk. Enthusiastic amateur researcher. Ever above to an extraordinarily strong and big pal? Just my speculation, but it seems to be some kind of leader who controls the pals around. If you can make it your ally, it sure would be handy, but it's super powerful, so be careful. Thank you. And what do you got to say, village chief? Have you ever been attacked by an enemy and lost a pal? If you have, try asking the pal merchant about it. They often find lost pals. If your pal is on the market, you might be able to buy it back. The rain poaching group is selling pals they've poached and stolen to merchants. Really, what a hor what horrible people they are. I just wish someone would take down the boss. I will someday. And now to hit the fast travel. Because now I can just come and go from this village, which will be nice. I can do a lot of my trading here. Oh, there's more smoke up that way. Let's go. Oh, and there's an effigy right here. Maybe it's another town. Oh. Oh, and there's a chest there, too. Oh, and mushrooms for eating. Yes, please. More gold. That's an egg all the way up there, isn't it? That is not a friendly camp. 
And that is a cage in the center of that camp. So they've got a prisoner of sorts. So it's got to be those stupid ruffians we keep seeing. The one that killed the merchant by my house. Fucking assholes. Yeah, I can see the flag from here. Do they have a pal in there? They do. Yeah. Fizzy, stop. Another Vox. Ow. Yo, you want to get in this fight? Oh, shit, you're like right beside me. Can I? Oh, good. I can release you. It's okay. It's okay. I got you. Well, now that we're safe, let's check out our pallet deck real quickly. Being extremely aggressive pallet often picks fights before gauging its opponent's strength. Though small, its powerful charge can even send boulders flying. Rush hole. Rush ore. Can be ridden, increases in f efficiency of destroying boulders while mounted. That's nice. The one who possesses the most impressive antlers becomes the leader of the herd. If their antlers are broken, they become depressed and leave the herd never to be seen again. Lumbering, level 2, nice. Can be ridden, can perform a double jump while mounted. Increases efficiency of cutting trees. The idol of the islands. If you bully a Vixie... You best be prepared to become enemies with the whole world. Uh, oops. There's more smoke that way. Can I get... Can I get down? Oh, there's an effigy over here, though. Oh, well, there's fire that way. And two effigies this way. Oh, shit! Don't fuck with my deer, dude. My deer will fuck you up. Oh, hello. What are you? I want you. Let's go! I got me a jolt hog. I'm gonna go with it's a electric hedgehog. Based off of the fact that it's called jolt hog. Just a guess. Alright, uh, what do we want to increase? We want to increase health. Because of what we're doing. Technology-wise, what are we going to learn? Uh, I mean, we obviously have to learn your saddle. And I want to learn your necklace. There's gloves for you. Okay. We'll need nails. I like the headband. I need that to upgrade. And a three-shot bow! Oh, hold on. There was also a feed bag, it said. So there. Uh, pallet deck wise, releases the electricity stored in its body when under attack, producing a shot that could be over 10 million volts. A thermic can even be more lethal than any conventional heavy, heavy weaponry. 
the Jolt Bomb. When activated, equips Jolt Hog to the player's hand. When thrown at an enemy, causes an electrical explosion upon impact. <gasps> Fuck. It looks like it's underneath me. I'm going to have to find a way down. And looks like it's another bad guy settlement, too. <gasps> I'm getting that egg. First. Hi. What are you? Oh, dark egg. Okay, so before I go over there, in case something bad happens, I want to be able to get the um fast travel. Because it looks like I've got two camps next to each other. What the fuck is a loop moon? Please don't be aggressive, because you're way more powerful than I am. Oh, I don't have a silver key. Damn it, a third one over there, too. Oh, they got grenades! Because you'll kill this. Yo! We caught it! I'm running out of arrows! Wow, another Vox. You guys must sell for a really good price. Poor thing. So there's one over there, but... Yep. Good job, Elk and Deer. Oh my. I'm only a level 10. I don't want to bring you down, but that's the first time I've seen one of those. That was cool looking. A wooly pop. Oh, I could get that. Let's get that. Whoa, shit.
Ooh. Come on, baby. Yeah, let's go. Do I still have you with me, T Funk? Cool. Hey, can you heal me a little bit? Thanks, T Funk. Oh my god, these guys are... Oh my god, he's got a goddamn flamethrower! Come back. Take it down slowly. Saw that coming a mile away. Somehow we hit those. Those guys got pissed off at me for those bad guys. <sighs> oh, we gotta go back to get my stuff though, man. Oh, are these world bosses? Chile, King Paka. Okay. Let's go, guys. Get it, Daydream. Good job. Is that just an egg sitting there? I think it is. You little shit. Okay, Daydream, I need you to come out. Oh, my armor is damaged. I wonder if I could sneak in here. Oh, nope. Daydream, come back. We're running. I'll take that soul, though. 
Okay, we're out of harm's way. But we did get the 30 pals that we wanted, so that's nice. Nine percent. Oh, good, we got it anyway. A crossbow schematic. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, no, my armor's damaged. I don't have any cloth. Guys, fight! Oh, ow. Give me all your shit. Alright, inventory, stat points, we're going with health again. Technology this time. What do we got? Oh, we could get the saddle. Metal pick. Metal axe. Which means we'll need a high quality work. We'll go with your submachine gun. Alright. We've got food to cook in. We finally got food back with them. I don't know how they didn't get any food. We're going to have to check to see what's going on with the farm. We've got arrows going. We're going to have to fix our armor. But on that note, ladies and gentlemen, we got our butts kicked by some level 20 syndicates. But we have a world boss right here, Chile. And you can capture the world bosses. And we are late level 11. We might try that after we check out the crossbow. So I'm going to get stuff ready to see if we can do the crossbow, make a crossbow, maybe get some new armor. Get these arrows made. And what do we need to do to upgrade the base? We need a primitive furnace and the hot springs. So we're going to be doing all of that on the next one. So of course as always everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. And don't forget to like. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And of course leave a message down below. It helps me. And thank you. Bye.